Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to this video series. Okay, in our previous episode, we have already designed a home page. So let's design the menu page in this video. First of all, this uh, title or breadcrumb section. Okay, so let's insert a one column section like this. And vertical line middle and funds let's set padding about 100 to the top 100 to the bottom then let's also insert an image okay here paste title use this widget make it a line center uh, heist to it's fine star then let's see breadcrumb okay then next section is this portfolio section okay let's insert a one column section Oh yeah, with padding about 150 to the top, 150 to the bottom. Then let's insert portfolio. Okay, portfolio widget. Carry products. okay and filter var so taxonomy categories okay column is fine purpose machinery okay. uh, so that, uh, mm -hmm. okay and yeah it is not showing displaying uh, the filter bar because of, uh, when I create this simple pose I have only one category products so yeah then if you do not want to see use this portfolio widget you can also try other regrettable is that well, elemental by native widget uh, only have this uh, product grid widget for the WooCommerce uh, other we do not have other uh, WooCommerce <laughs> product layout widgets if you want you can try any other 
uh, add-ons there are many free and paid add-ons then next okay view more new dishes for this one okay mm. sorry uh, we forgot to add this one so um, let's go to the WPMN and let's create let's add a few product categories to this uh, sample products at the same time uh, let's copy the setting for this title from the home page okay here go to the products and let's assign few simple categories for example this one create it uh, category okay let's select okay and that is okay at the same time let's go to the home page and it is a bit elemental okay let's copy this with set copy this bring it to our menu page and paste it here sorry bring it to the top what's new what's popular okay I'm dead this and refresh this piece section is this one okay and this is this uh, advertisement uh, or promotional um, banner if you have any uh, promotions uh, you can add it here if not you can just skip it And for this one, this is the, it is just a timeline or it's, you know, process with that. Let's see if we have a, any suitable for with this year. For example, yeah, history. Let's see this with that. Okay. Horizontal. But again.
okay this one one okay first step It is of power right foot. So there is no icon option. We have to upload it here. So separately, it is not linked to the Elementor default for no some icon. So let's upload it differently. Uh, for now, um, okay. Let's go to Privy Con mm, on sorry plat icons. Put okay. Let's download now. It is PNZ and SBZ only, so SBZ is premium. So <laughs> let's download this PNZ. If you are using this on your website, don't forget to give credits to here. Don't forget to give credits to this author by copying this link. And I have also already created a video on how to give credits to this uh, player icon or free pick such websites for using their or free resources. Okay. Let's support this. That's it. Oh, too large, I think. So let's go to a style. Let's see line color. Circle color. Circle size twenty. Oh. Beautiful MS 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 Oops. Oops. Uh, I was expecting for the image size of the resizing option, but there is none here. 
there is both the radius option border tab box shadow overlay color but no for image resizing okay then here mm, yeah also there is no option for image resize, size selection yeah this is a very good widget but uh, I think uh, I think it needs to improve few features since uh, image resizing is not working properly uh, yeah then we cannot resize here in this widget we have to go to editor like pixlr.com then let's edit this Okay. Access man. Transform this is no. This Is this one okay let's let's uh, reduce this to 150 to 150 okay let's save it again in web format save save it let's go back since this image Sorry. Insert. Okay. Now it's good. Since the last size is not uh, resizing, it's not working. So we have to upload a smaller image size. And at the same time here, let's change the color for this here. Background color to yeah. Padding twenty. Typography size thirty. Oh. Mm -hmm. Lab 20, right 20. Okay, looks better. The only regrettable is that if we cannot make it circular, there is no border radius option for this year, and that's regrettable. Mm -hmm. Okay, then duplicate this. This is number two. Check out. This now the not smaller size, for example, here. By default, we do not have 150 pixels, so either we edit it here or download this image. Again, and yeah, come back here. Paste it here. Then 
you did size one fifty relative one fifty oh applied no it is not working so base uh, resize scale okay one fifty applied okay set this web b Check out come back here unload this okay Check out. From your card. or card POS with kids or debit cards this press it here sorry to this to this widget section watch and the same time 
copy this paste it here mm -hmm. yeah let's set view margin about 40 at the top yeah space get your put pass and easy let's reduce little let's hit here to about 40 pixel okay Paste. Let's copy the call to action section. Okay, let's copy this section and bring it here to the menu paste. Paste it here. Okay. That's it. Uh, we are done with the menu page and uh, thanks for watching this video from the beginning to the end and I hope you learned something new especially for those beginners and if you find this helpful don't forget to leave your comment feedbacks and if you have any questions doubts contact me on this comment section or to whatsapp or facebook I'm willing to help you out clear your doubts and stay tuned for the upcoming next episode okay don't forget to like this video subscribe my youtube channel click on the notification bell icon okay see you in the next episode bye bye